don't like it. It's, it's no, no numbers. There's no pictures. There's no videos. There's no, no gameplay. I, I don't like it. I don't like it. Yo, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope everyone's having a good day so far. And today, Freemers, we are going to talk about something that has happened in Pally recently or is actively ongoing in the community, and I thought we'd talk about this. Today, we're going to be talking about flow tree groves, not flow trees in particular, just the groves that are, you know, that are around the map that spawn at midnight that people get excited about. That's what we're going to talk about today, so let's just jump into it. First thing I want to start with is what happened in a recent Palia episode, which was the 100th episode of our Palia playthrough, which, by the way, that's a lot of episodes, so if you guys have been watching all 100 of them, thank you. I appreciate it, but we're going to get to the kind of meat of that episode, so that episode... Basically, we did a whole treasure hunt. We were trying to get the rest of the treasure for two achievements, and also um, the Pebbled Plunder achievement, which we did get. But the main meat of that episode was something that happened while we were looking for chests. And basically, it, uh, you know what? Instead of me talking about it, I'm going to show you guys in this clip. Like there? I don't know. This is a weird one. Oh, I found the grove. Oh. I found the grove by myself. Oh, I'm sorry, no one called this out. Why did no one call this out? One, two, three, four, five, six, what the, I'm, I'm triggered. Oh, I'm not chopping. I'm not helping you guys chop that down. Dude, I, what did I just, I witnessed a crime. So basically what happened, if you didn't catch it in that clip, is, <laughs> it's kind of wild. Two people came up to a flow tree grove after I had found it, when I called it out and people were saying they're on their way. Two people chopped down the grove themselves without saying a word, not saying a single thing. I was stunned. I didn't even finish the grove. I, I got most of the trees, but I did not finish it entirely. And this is the exact thing I want to talk about today because it's apparently a very controversial thing in the community. And, you know, I, I had no idea. 
So, you know, it's it's just it's a weird thing and I just want to discuss it. Now, to kind of start with this, let's talk about flow tree groves. What are they? How important are they to the community, etc.? So, flow tree groves every every night at midnight, exactly at 12, a flow tree grove spawns. Now, what happens is usually I'll ask where the grove is. Sometimes I'll find it on my own. I think that was the only time I found it on my own that one time. But basically, everyone will call out the grove in the chat, or someone will, and say where it is, and then we'll go. Everyone will go to that grove. We'll hit the tree once, and then someone will give a time on when we're chopping. If there's more people coming, we will wait. That's kind of how the flow tree grove works. And basically, you get a bunch of wood from it. You get a bunch of a bunch of like flow wood planks and stuff like that from it. Um, and it's just a it's a nice little community thing, and I like it a lot. Now, what happened in the clip was very unfortunate. Um, basically, two people, they came and just chopped the grove on their own without saying a word. And I'm not going to, you, you, you can see it in the episode, but basically what ended up happening was I, <laughs> I was trying to figure out what was going on. These two people, just they were chopping trees in the whole Bahari Bay nonstop without saying a word. And I was calling them out, which for some reason, we'll talk about this. For some reason, I'm the bad guy in the situation. So basically, I called, you know, I called them some names, not even slurs, right? I called them names. I called them loser because, dude, they are a loser. They're literally, what they're doing is wrong. They're chopping down the grove without waiting for the people that were coming, right? And then I did call them jerks because, dude, they were jerks in the episode. And then people were starting to, like, go against me on this. Like, you know, you politely remind them to chop the grove down. You know, you ask them to wait next time. And I'm just like, dude, I do understand that this is a cozy game, right? But the biggest thing with the economy right now in Palia is we're all trying to get this. Like, Pallium, I don't think, is a rare resource anymore for people. I don't think any I don't think I've seen anyone call it out. If they do call it out, you know, they're being nice. But the thing is with flow wood, like flow tree grove and flow trees all around Bahari Bay, the problem with it is it's they they're gone. Once you once you hit the tree and it falls down, it is gone. It doesn't come back. So my issue with this is like people were going against me and being like, uh, "You're you're the bad guy in this situation." Like, like, I don't understand how I'm the bad guy in the situation, dude. Like, this is such a... The, the flow tree grove is a thing for everyone to come and get. It's not for two people to come and get, you know? And I do want to talk about a little bit more about the... After, I mean, I have trauma from this, dude. Like, I have trauma from these flow tree groves. I'm not going to go for a flow tree grove again until they fix this whole system. Because it's a mess. It's just... Dude, it doesn't work. Okay? But I want to show you guys something that I recently did in the Palia Discord to kind of get this conversation going. So, Freemers, recently I went to the Palia Discord, and I basically threw up a poll, because apparently you can do that in Discord. You can just throw up polls, which I should be doing, but I'm, I didn't know this was a thing. Anyway, I wanted to know the Palia's, like the Palia community's overall take on the situation. Now, the votes here, I asked, is it okay to chop down a grove without waiting for people first? Eight votes said yes. Those people are weird. Twenty-eight votes said no. So it's seven. It's it's an eighty-twenty split basically. Now, what's interesting about this is this is apparently controversial. So there's some people that believe if no one said they were on their way, it's okay to just go and chop it down. Like there's like people in the the Discord. A lot of people were disagreeing with me, and a lot of people were being like, "Yeah, no, it's not okay." Because dude, there is. There is a etiquette in the game that I have noticed, and obviously, you know, I chop down, uh, I chop down trees that are just alone, right, on my own if there's no one around, and if I can do it by myself, and then if there's Palliamor, that I don't call out because that's, you know, if someone sees it, they'll go and get it. it it's a node that disappears, but yeah, it, it's really like you know, people are apparently like they're tired of waiting, like if they're just doing their own thing. Yeah, it's weird. But I do think I know the etiquette in the game that, like, you know, people play different ways. But the etiquette in the game is that you let people know if there's a flow tree grove. You don't just chop it down without waiting. If people were saying they're on their way, you you wait. You don't just chop it down on your own. It's, dude, I think it's a really weird thing. 
Like, he's, I, I believe it's common courtesy, dude, to let people know about the growth, to wait for them to chop at a certain time, etc. It's super, super odd that people are against this in some way. Like, there's just, there's this split, you know? And hopefully at some point, Singularity 6 finds a way to, like, make this fair. Like, so make it like a node to where you chop the tree down and it's still there until you get there. Like, I think that needs to happen. Um, just because, like, I don't know. But in, in saying this, that would mean a lot of things, which means they would have to change not just the flow trees, but every single tree would have to be a node. When everything starts to become a node, I think the game gets a little more glitchy, but yeah, man, this is this was a thing that traumatized me in that episode. We were having a good old time until this came up because, you know, originally I had heard about this happening. I heard that groves were being chopped down without anyone saying anything and two and apparently two people ruined it for the entire server. That being said, like, I had never seen it happen, and when I saw it happen, my jaw dropped. I, I didn't know what to say. I really didn't. That is why I freaked out in that episode the way I did. I was losing my mind. I was like, are you kidding me? You're going to do that? Really? It's like, it, it's the weirdest thing, dude. I, I don't know, man. I really, I really want to see Singularity 6 change this. You know, I think it would be good for the community if we saw a change like that to where it's just going to be like nodes but i think nodes will lag the game and that's going to be a problem but overall i think it would help the game better like instead of the flow trees just disappearing but i want to know your guys' thoughts on this do you think it's okay to chop down a grove without waiting for people first obviously you know my answer i voted no it's not okay it's not okay in the slightest i don't like here's the thing i don't really care if you play differently it is common courtesy in the game to let everyone have a shot at the grove, okay? Because it's the flow tree wood, that's, it's hard to get. It's not like pallium where it's just like around the map. It's hard to get, it's hard to get the wood, dude, because not all the servers are populated with wood. It's like, I don't know, man. I'm just like, I'm a little flabbergasted at the whole situation. Um, and you could, you could tell in that episode, I was just, it was on my mind constantly. And now... I'm not going to go for a flow tree grove anymore because of this until they implement a fix to where they can act like nodes. Cause Oh my Lord, it is wild. <laughs> this is a, it was a wild situation. I still, by the way, I did in the episode, I did block the people that did that and I reported them because you know, it, it wasn't nice. It's not nice. I don't think anyone who does that is a nice person. They're just like, they're a little self-centered. They're a little selfish. Okay. I will say that. It's a little, it's, come on. It's common courtesy to let people know about a grove. And if people say they're on the way, then let them come, okay? I'm just saying, man. I'm just saying, listen. Listen. Just saying. But anyway, that's going to be the video for today. But thank you guys for watching. If you did, I appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.